Title, Larsa Pippen's Top Secret Rom-Com Tactics, Alias Love with Marcus Jordan. TL, DR, reality star Larsa Pippen divulged her early days romance stealth operations when she hid the true identity of her man, Marcus Jordan, under a fake phone contact. To all those secretly harboring a high-profile relationship or wanting to keep their affairs hush-hush, this is your cue. Seems like Larsa Pippen has figured out the modern-day recipe for covert love ops and the secret ingredient. Faux phone contacts. But how long can you keep a secret, especially when it involves a celebrity as prominent as Marcus Jordan? Let's dive in, folks. Our favorite 48-year-old reality TV star unveiled her clandestine tactic in their recent podcast, shedding light on the early days of her relationship with Marcus Jordan. Now, this is some serious Bond-level shenanigans. Pippin confessed that she had to resort to using an alias for her boyfriend on her phone to throw off any scent of their budding romance. Think of it as romantic espionage, secretive, mysterious, and intriguing all at once. While this may seem like an everyday move to some, come on we've all had that Pizza Hut contact, right? When it comes to the glittering world of Hollywood, maintaining a private relationship could be likened to performing a Houdini-level magic trick. What's interesting is that this secret phone contact wasn't just a random name. Imagine you're scrolling through your contact list and you come across a name like Big Bird or Chewbacca. It raises a chuckle and a furrowed eyebrow, right? But this was a well-thought-out, deceptively simple alias, one that was just nondescript enough to go unnoticed among the sea of names. It's no wonder she managed to keep this up for quite some time. So, now that we've shared this little secret, it's time to ponder the implications. Are covert phone contacts a necessary evil in high-profile relationships, or just another instance of stars playing spy games? Does this move amplify the privacy issues that celebrities already face? Or is it just a sign of our ever-evolving digital society where even love needs to go undercover? Before we sign off, it's important to remember, you should never imitate such actions without understanding the potential repercussions. Privacy is paramount, and each situation requires its own unique approach. This is an intriguing tale, not advice. So, what's your take, folks? Is Lars's move a survival strategy for the modern love battlefield, or is it just another blip in the Hollywood privacy saga? Could you pull off a similar ruse or does your heart believe in transparent love? Now, over to you, let's get the ball rolling in the comment section.